William, good evening. How are you? Good evening, teacher. How are you? How, how are you today? Great, teacher. That's great. That's, that's great. That's great. I sent you a manual. Le envío un manual. Can you hear me? How you said? Yes. Okay, I can hear you. Yo lo escucho. Aquí está lloviendo algo fuerte. Oh, I sent you a manual. Le envío un manual. Okay, we are going to wait for the rest of the class to appear. Vamos a esperar por el resto de sus compañeros. Pregúnteme algo para que avancemos. Okay, well, I was telling you that I sent you a manual. Le decía que le envié un manual. Did you get it? No, teacher. Este, after the class, lo enviaré. Okay. Okay, perfect. What about the platform? How are you doing with the platform? ¿Cómo vamos con la plataforma? Very well, teacher. Let me check. You are William Rosale. William, William, William. In the platform, in the, in the plataforma, ¿cómo vamos? Well, oh, yeah, yeah, 96. Tengo algunas dudas, pero ahí vamos, ahí. Voy no, a tratar de me poner, voy a ir al día ahí. That's, actually, that's very good. Realmente está muy bueno. It's a great average. Bastante buena nota. Yeah, because you let's see, yeah. Yes, it's good, the it's next, good. Excellent. Teacher. teacher. Yes. The next weekend. Uh, tendré, ¿cómo se dice? I will have. I will have the next the next weekend vacation. Oh really? Yes. That's great. That's excellent. I will have the next week. Así, verdad? I will. No. Next week, I will have vacation. Next week, I will have vacation. That's excellent. How many days? ¿Cuántos días? 15. 15 days. Oh, Cool. That's excellent. That's excellent. Ahí voy a estudiar eso, un poco más para ponerme al día, teacher. Sí, en esos días le voy a dejar trabajito extra. No problem. Thanks. Excellent. Just remind me. Solo me acuerdo. What? Just remind me. Solo me recuerda. Perfect. Yeah, because that way I can leave you something. That's right, yeah, I just. need, I need este, more hunger. And no problem, no problem. My problem. Thanks, teacher. No problem, my friend. Everything's okay. Well, let's see, it's time. Just let me text your classmates. Solo déjeme escribirle a sus compañeros que ya es hora. Teacher, explica bastante bien. Me gusta, me gusta la dinámica que llevan. No, thanks to you, my friend. A, a veces, tal vez no, no hablo mucho, pero estoy bien pendiente de lo que dicen. Excellent, that's excellent. Quiero ir, quiero ir este, digamos, agrandando el vocabulario. Big vocabulary. It's, yeah, increase. Increase the vocabulary. Yes. Agrandar, incrementar en este caso. Es esta palabra, mira. Increase. Increase vocabulary. Increase vocabulary. 
to the That's prison. good. I mean, yeah, that's the way it must be. Así debe ser. Well, William, it's been nice talking to you. Qué bueno hablar con usted. Welcome to the class. Thank you. Thanks, teacher. Oh, thanks to you. Marta. Hello, Marta. Hello, teacher. Good evening. Good evening. How are you? I'm good, teacher. What about you? I'm just great. Excellent. Excellent. How do you feel in your hands? I'm sorry? How do you feel with your hands? My hand. Oh, hands. well, you, you know, actually, uh, I hurt myself, myself today. Why? Because Are you moved, maybe? No, the problem was that there was a, a leak. Ah, okay. okay. No, una gotera. Ah, okay. okay, okay. And I was trying I'm to so fix sorry. it. And it hurt, but just a little bit. I'm so sorry, teacher. So what about be you? Careful. Mark? Yeah, I will be. What about you? Tell me, how was your day? What did you do today? Uh, my day is uh, a little busy. Uh, I have... Many cases. I had. I had many cases, okay. but I resolved all. It's, it's okay. Okay, but I solved them all. Like this, look. But I solved them all. Okay, teacher. Thank you. And what about the weekend, Marta? What did you do during the weekend? Uh, this weekend was uh, a little visit too. I received oh, really? personal good news. Oh, uh, really? So great. Um, it's, it's cool. <laughs> I nice. am ready nice. for, for, for the class, teacher. That's excellent. That's excellent. Welcome to the class, Marta. Thank you, teacher. Let's see, Francisco Jose, hello, how are you? Francisco Jose, hello. Oops, perhaps there's a problem with the microphone. Let's see. Daniel Eduardo. Hello, good evening, Mr. Hello, good evening. How are you? I'm fine. And you? I'm just great, just great. So tell me, Daniel, how was your weekend? I remember you had great. to work, right? Actually, you had to work. You told me, right? Yeah, but uh, yesterday we went with the family to Acajutla. And we oh, yes. ended up at Apanex. Yeah. Oh, that's nice. Yeah, so you, re finally you relax. Yeah, yeah. That's good. That's good. Excellent. It's always good when we can, like, disconnect a little bit from the stress of everyday activities yeah that's great okay and tell me what are the plans for the week mm, maybe well go out with the family and the schools because in that but well, well in afaneca the food was really really good oh really yeah that's cool. I mean, to change a little bit the, 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 the environment and the weather and everything. Yeah, the weather was really, really cold. Really nice. Oh, that's, 
That's nice, man. Because where do you live, Daniel? Eh, Mexicano. Yeah, hot. Yeah. Terribly hot. And yeah, that, really hot. That thing, Mexicanos is downtown San Salvador. Yeah. Very hot. Yeah. Well, thank you, Daniel, and welcome to the class. Thanks. Ambar, hello, Ambar. Hello, teacher. How are you? I'm just fine. What about you, Amber? Well, um, I was a, I I have a good day, but in I have a good weekend too. Oh, really? What did you do in the weekend? Tell me, tell me. Well, on on Saturday. On Saturday, uh, you went to watch the game. I remember you had an invitation. Yes, and in the afternoon, I spend time with my friends. Uh, we we watch the match. Okay. And on Sunday, uh, I went to church with my mom, and and then I went to supermarket. In the afternoon, I take a long nap. <laughs> I took. I took, sorry. Okay, tell me, Amber, which team were you supporting? Sorry, can Argentina, you repeat? Which team were you supporting, Argentina or Brazil? I prefer Brazil, but... Uh, I'm so sorry but for you. <laughs> Argentina okay. is a champion. <laughs> yeah, Argentina. 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 Yes. Yeah, they are. It was, it was interesting. It was a pretty interesting game. Yes. I remember I was anxious watching it. Sorry? Me, I watched the game and I was very anxious. Really? Yeah, yeah you... because I support Argentina. Oh. Um... Yeah, oh, I, I think you 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 feel happy for Messi, right? Well, actually, I support most the more the, the team rather than the players. Realmente lo mío es más con el equipo que con un jugador en específico. Oh, I understand. Well. Nice talking to you, Amber, and welcome to the class. Thank you, teacher. Let's see. Hey, Walter, how are you? Walter, where did you go? Oops, I lost him. Let's see who else is around. Hey, Nicolas, how are you? Good evening, teacher. Good evening. Good evening. How are you? Fine, thank you, teacher. How, how are you? How are you, Nicolas? I'm fine. I'm fine. My day is, is good. No problem. Was good. Was good. Was good. Okay. okay. What about the weekend? What did you do in the weekend? Wait, my weekend is spectacular. Was spectacular. Was spectacular. Spectacular. Okay. Spectacular. Okay, what uh, did you do? Tell me. Tell well, me a little bit. Um, from Saturday, I watched TV. Okay. I watch a sport, only sport. Okay. Hey, I watch UFC. Okay. Oh, man, you just remind me UFC. That was terrible. McGregor. The, the, yeah. It's good. <laughs> yeah, but it was horrible. The, 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 the injury. In la, la. Oh, injury. ¿Cómo se dice? Rio. 
No, 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 pero cuando hacemos la lesión. The uh -huh. injury was horrible. La eh. lesión fue horrible. You know, actually my, my, my wife broke her leg in exactly the same way. A mi esposa se le quebró el pie exactamente de la misma manera. ¿A quién le tiraba patadas? Actually, she was just walking. Realmente estaba caminando in a step this high, en una gradita así de alta. Uh, she twisted her ankle and broke her leg in two different pieces, en dos partes distintas. Mm -hmm. So it was uh, horrible. Well, and the the other the other events in the UFC events uh, events events in UFC on Saturday it's very good las peleas fueron muy buenas yeah 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 the rest of the fights the rest, the rest of the fight the rest, the rest of, of the fights yeah they were actually they were they were the they were a couple there were a couple of nice knockouts. Yes, yes. And other in other moments, I watch uh, the soccer and okay. the, 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 uh, the play of Brazil from an Argentina, Ar Argentina. Against, against, Again. in contra de, against. Against eh, Brazil against Argentina. Yeah. Again. Or you can say, or you can say, you can say versus. Ah, uh, versus. Okay. Okay. I watch TV. Eh, the 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 final, the football the final. Of, the final of football soccer. Eh, against uh, of Brazil against or ver, versus versus Argentina. Okay, so you will really have fun this weekend. Si se divirtió. On Sunday, I watched the game of England uh, against Italy. 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 Oh, Italy. man, yeah. Italy won. Cool. Yes. Yes, I I am fanatic of Italy. Okay, I'm a fan. I am fan. I am a fan of Italy. Me too. Me too. Me Actually, too. I am too. I am too. Yo también. Okay. Well, thank you, Nicolas. Interesting talking to you, and welcome to the class. Hey, thank you, teacher. Maria Alejandra, hello. Hello, teacher. Good evening. Good evening. How are you? I'm fine. <laughs> okay. I'm... What did you do this weekend? I went to the cinema. The cinema. Okay. You went to the movies? That's cool. Uh -huh. Which movie I did you watch? Uh, the Black Widow. Love oh, me. what? Is it nice? Is it any good? Mm, yes, maybe. I don't know. I don't understand almost, but uh -huh. my friend really like, and I pass the, I pass my time uh, with them. And okay, listen, I, listen. I spent. I spent. I spent my time with them. I spend my time with them and talking uh, so the different topic and the time is pass very quick or very fast. And the Saturday only that in the Sunday and on Sunday on, on Sunday. Sunday and 
I visit uh, my, uh, my mother and my grandmother. And I went to the supermarket. And only that. Okay, that's cool. So you were busy. <laughs> Maybe. Well, welcome to the class, Maria. Thank you, teacher. Let's see who else is around. Walter, you're back. Hello, Walter. Hello, I don't hear you. I think we are having problems with the microphone, Walter. Let's see, we will talk with somebody else. Try to fix it, take it easy, no problem. Try to arreglar algo, no hay problema. Vamos a hablar con alguien más, para mí mientras. Shanira, hello. Hello, teacher, good evening. Good evening, how are you? I'm good, and you? I'm just fine, here. Same old story. <laughs> okay, on um, Saturday? So yeah, tell me, tell me, what did you do? On Saturday, I went to the park with my dog. Imagine, four dog ran in different way. It was very hard, <laughs> but it was took funny. your dogs to the park? Yes, I, I went to the park with my four dog. <laughs> to walk? Uh, well, no walk, they don't walk. They, they run <laughs> all the time. Imagine okay. I walk uh, 20, 21, uh, what do you say, 21 mil? 21,000? 21,000 step, maybe nine kilometers uh, with them. Okay. When, when I, did they when pay I, you or something? Le pagaron or <laughs> I, uh, um, I enjoy it. I enjoy it. Really enjoy it. Man. But when I came, they don't, they don't make me walk that long. <laughs> I mean, but when when I came to my house, I really, I really um, tired. I, I take was a really tired. I was really tired. I took a shower and got to the bed. And went to bed. And went to bed. And on Sunday, yes. uh, I dry a lot because I, I, drove, my, I drove. I drove. I drove a lot because I pick pick up my mom. I picked. I picked. I picked, I picked my mom and go and went to my grandmother. Okay, I picked my mom up. Okay, I, I picked my mom up uh, and went to Suchitoto. Uh, when <laughs> did you go to Suchitoto? On Sunday. Oh, really? Yesterday, I, yes. I, I was there on Saturday. Oh, really? Yeah, hate it. It's, it's a, hot. yes, it's hot. It's a, what do you say, feria? A uh, fair. A fair, you can see? You can saw? Could you see? Could you see? Could you see, Could you see the fair? Not really. I just went to have lunch. So if uh, you went to Suchitoto, you passed like two blocks from my house. Si fue Suchitoto, pasó como a dos cuadras de mi casa. Yeah, because I pass uh, San Martín. Yeah, and I live, uh, let me see, no, one block and a half. Yo vivo a cuadra y media de la calle that takes you to Suchitoto. Ah, uh, really? Yep. That's why I tell you, you pass pretty close to my house. <laughs> yes. 
and I took the lunch in uh, Los Cerditos, Los Lechones de Santa Lucia. You know? Oh, yeah. This place? Yeah, I know there. Yes. And uh, I play soccer at night. All right. And that's it. Ah, I, and, I, and I saw the, the, the last fight, the U, UFC. UFC. And no more. That's, that's okay. only. <laughs> interesting, interesting. Very good. Today, Thank you very much. Yes, today, tell me, tell me. Today, I, I get the second. I got. I got the second dos. Those. Those of vaccine. Of COVID vaccine. Of COVID vaccine. Oh, really? Yeah. Ouch. But I um, feel, I feel How better, do you feel? Better. I feel, feel good. good. Yeah. Okay. Oh, man, you know May myself. Maybe. Maybe it was water. I don't know <laughs> because I feel normal. Yeah, my son is getting his tomorrow huh? at eight a.m. Imagine, and I have to take him all the way to San Salvador. Man, that's terrible. <laughs> I, I will went, have. I I, I went will have to, to wake Lourdes. up around five. I, I went to, to Lourdes. wake up around five. Teacher, I went to know all this. Where do you live now? In Apopa. You went from Apopa to Lourdes. Yes. Because no, that's I crazy. had I had a a day? No, it's not a day. How do you say Sita? Mm. Yeah. Now another a kind of day. <laughs> appointment. Appointment. Okay, I appointment. Appointment. I confuse the word teacher. Appointment. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Okay, that's interesting. Never have an appointment with your boyfriend and a day with your doctor. Okay, it's the other way around. <laughs> okay, okay. <laughs> Remember, the date is with your boyfriend. The appointment is with the doctor. Okay, okay. Thank you, teacher. Now, ah, thanks to you, and welcome to the class, Janita. Thank you, teacher. Let's see, let's see who else is around. There's Daniel, we already talked to Daniel. Claudia Ramos, hello, Claudia. How are you? Hello, teacher. Hi, and you? Well, here, you know, same old, same old. La misma vieja historia, so I can say that I'm okay, I'm full, fine. Okay, who's... I don't hear teacher. I am fine, what about you? How's everything? Um, I'm stressed, I'm stressed. You're stressed, why? Why are you stressed? I, when on Sunday, I have an event with an my event? family. And Um, oh, really? And so you are tired. I don't. Está, está cansada. Yes, teacher. Okay, that's tired. Yeah, you know, whenever we have like events like that, like family gatherings, so uno puede decir family meetings, family reunions, y otra manera también de decirlo. Is family gatherings. It's the same, family reunion, family meeting, family gatherings. The three sentences are the same. That's the same. Yeah, whenever we have family reunions, man, that's tiresome. It's what comes out. I know. So tell me, what was for food? La parte interesante, que hubo de comida? Um. Yes, Claudia? 
we are we ate a chicken. Okay. How did you prepare your chicken? ¿Cómo lo prepararon? I don't hear it's raining. Okay, no problem, Claudia. Let's see. Estoy Thank tratando you. de entender, pero... No problem. Later, 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 later. Fernando, hello, Fernando. How are you? Mr. Fernando Gonzalez, how are you? Besides, can you hear me? Yes, I can. It's raining here. Okay, can you hear me? Uh, yes, uh, un poco cortado. Okay, how was your weekend? My weekend. Uh, my weekend was um, a little bit tired. Uh, Saturday I was in my house. I was cleaning my house. So this word is is um, hard. Okay. And yeah, yesterday, yesterday I was relaxing a little uh, in the morning, and at noon I I saw the European. Good final. After them, uh, I go out. I went out with my family to eat some snack. And for the dinner, I went to eat tacos. Oh, and, cool. And just that, it's my weekend. <laughs> okay, European, European. A European. Okay. European. Uh, Y para usar el, 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 el diminutivo que, os, que se utiliza en todos lados. Uh -huh. Lo último que me dijo. Europe, o sea, yeah, Europe. Recogiendo. Yeah, Europe, yeah. But actually, Porque yeah. Bien es europea. Yep. Yeah. Pero, digamos como... Eh, bueno, yo he visto que ellos no le llaman europea, ¿verdad? sino que solo euro. Yeah, the euro. Yeah, well, it was good. It was a good, it was a good match. Fue muy buen juego. Yes, yes. Uh, it was uh, entertaining or entretenido. Yeah, entertaining. Entertaining, okay. It was entertainment. Uh, it was Italy. Yeah. And what about uh, the last game of the day? del último partido del día. Did you watch El Salvador? Um, more or less. Uh, <laughs> always we always we play against Guatemala and, and most of the time. The majority of the time. Yeah, most of the most time. Most of the time is. It's a tight zero zero. <laughs> so, yeah. This well, but last night they won. Game. Yes. Well, so I saw the the goals. Okay, that's cool. That's cool. <laughs> Excellent. Well, Thank you, Fernando, and welcome to the class. Thank you, teacher. Wilfredo, my friend, how are you? Hi, teacher. How's everything? How are you, teacher? I am fine. What about you, Wilfredo? Nice. A little, a little tired, but it is okay. Okay. Tell me, how was the weekend? What did you do during the weekend? It was very good, teacher, because I was watching so so matches soccer soccer matches and it was good because argentina won the the championship and italy won too and i like uh, i like this this match because they they 
they call show a good a good show. Okay, that's good. Yeah. yeah. It was of entertaining course. as Fernando said. Yeah, yeah. And the selector, of course, won. It, oh, it was yeah. good. It was good. And uh, yesterday, it was, the after, and it was a little bit different. Un poco distinto. Yeah. They they but won. They won, but but show a good level, teacher. Different oh. to another matches. Uh, we'll see, we'll see. Ya veremos, ya veremos. Maybe you know, we'll see against Mexico. Uh, yeah. We'll see, we'll see. Ya veremos, ya veremos. I mean, it's complicated with these guys. It's un poquito complicado. Because we we can hope about them many many things for example when when they sell the matches I, it, it, we lost the illusion yeah yeah actually but, it it was let's see it was disappointing it was disappointing decepcionante Disappointing, disappointing. Yeah, it was disappointing. Most of the time, it's disappointing. <laughs> yeah, well, yeah, but that was worse. Yeah. Okay. That, by that by the way, teacher, that the the year the year final, it was better the American Cup final. What do you think? Uh the game, the game, the show. Actually, it's just that uh, it's different. You know, in, in South America, it's more physical, the way they play soccer. Um, and in yeah. Europe, in Europe, they tend to be a little bit more technical, but in South America, it's pretty physical. And all countries yeah. are like that. They might know it. <laughs> yeah. <laughs> but it was interesting. Thank you very much, Wilfredo. Thank okay, you, guys, bef before I move on, I need to get the attendance. Let's see. Let me get everything ready so I can take your attendance. Okie dokie, let's see. Okay, let's see. Who do I got here? Ambarelli Alfaro Gomez. Present teacher. Thank you. Carlos Antonio Murillo Hernandez. Claudia Lisset Ramos Barrientos. Daniel Eduardo Segueda Valencia. Present teacher. Eduardo Ademir Noyola Brito. Elvia Janet Beltrán de Cabrera. Present teacher. Fernando Marvin González Martínez. Present teacher. Oops, Daisy. Thank you. Francisco Eduardo Figueroa Mejía. Present teacher, present. Thank you, Francisco. José Ernesto Osorio Morán. Present teacher. Thank you, Jose. María Alejandra Barrientos Romero. Present teacher. María Luisa Morales de Corpeño. Yes. There. Marta Anabelinda Morales de Portillo. Present teacher. Nicolás San, Nicolás Atilio Méndez Granados. Present teacher. Thank you. Roxana Ivette Asensio de Mejía. Present. Silvia Elizabeth Avendaño Pineda. Present teacher. Susana Beatriz Ortiz de Cornejo. Present teacher. Walter Mauricio Morales Araujo. Hmm. 
Walter is having problems with connection. Wilfredo Guardado Rivera. Present teacher. William Giovanni Rosales Galvez. Present teacher. Thank you. Shanira Elizabeth Asensio Garcia. Present teacher. Francisco Jose Mendez Aguilar. And Linda Present Marlene. Oh, thank you, Francisco. I'm sorry. And Linda Marlene Acosta Barrera. Okie dokie. Let's see. Let's see, guys. Well, let's continue. We are still talking. Uh, let's see. Let's see. Let's see. Elvia, where are you, Elvia? I could have sworn I saw Elvia around. Elvia Janet, hello. Good evening. Oops, perhaps Elvia is having problems with the connection. Let me see, guys. Before we move on, I just need to check on something. Oh my gosh. Okay, let's see. Well, today, you know, we are going to talk about uh, a little bit different topics. We're going to have something pretty interesting to check on. And let's see, one of our first activities is to talk about management, management. What do you think of managers, okay? Let's see, let's see. I got here somebody who has not participated yet. And that's... Uh, okay. That's Sylvia. Hello, Sylvia, how are you? Sylvia Vendaño. Good evening. Mm. Well, Shanira, your turn. Health up. I am a volunteer. Yeah, you are the volunteer today. Okay. Tell me, Janira, what characteristics do you think uh, a manager should have? I think so the management um, could be a leader, how do you say leader? A leader. A leader. And the first and make make it the the thing because it's okay. necessary make uh, uh, make the example for another. Okay. Okay. Perfect. To be an example for the rest. Yeah. To be an example for the rest. And what more? Um, maybe. Uh, how to say amable? Uh, I forgot the word. Um, kind, kind, perhaps. Uh, I, I know another word, but I don't remember. Yeah, kind. And, but then, but almost need to make hard when it's necessary. Okay, well, you can say friendly, you can say kind, you can say nice. Um, maybe hmm, friendly, there. maybe friendly is okay. Yeah, you can say friendly. You can say amiable. Okay. Amiable is exactly like that. Or pleasant. pleasant. Amiable. Or, or perhaps, friendly is okay. Yeah, or gentle. Gentle. Yeah, gentle. This is the word. 
Gentle. Thank you. Gen gentle. Gentle. Yeah. Gentil. Amable. Gentle. Okay. Thank you very much, Janina. Okay, okay, guys. The question I asked Janina was exactly this. What do you think are the characteristics of a good manager? Okay. Now, guys, you're going to work in groups of three, and I need you to make at least of uh, at least five, five characteristics that you think a good manager should have. Okay. I need those characteristics sent to me on written. One of you is going to send them to me, and I am going to choose one person from the group to explain them to me. Okay. So let me create the group because we are going to group work in groups of three members. Groups are created, please jump in. Hi guys. Hi. What is the action in, in this moment? You need to create five characteristics you need to tell me five characteristics you consider a good manager should have usted me dirá cinco características que ustedes consideran que debe de tener un buen gerente okay. honestly and yeah. um no o other other characteristic and ten characteristics say say the teacher five 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 ah five <laughs> yes only two okay eh, Francisco. Yeah, tell me. What about you? The characteristic for the manager. So in this case, I think so. Uh, the manager needs to have a good patient with the, the personnel. I think so was the most important in this case. I uh, will be they will be honestly, like say the other partner and will be transparent. And, and the other things will be the- uh -huh. About the position. Okay, I'm sorry to interrupt. Roxana, are you going Hi. to stand me up again? Uh, sorry? Me dejará plantado de nuevo? No, no, teacher. Oh, okay, voy, cool. voy a... Sí, porque yeah. no sé si mañana me muero, entonces mañana. <laughs> yeah, yeah, we yeah, yeah. Don't, don't say that. Well, sí, if no. you do, if you do, tell me where it's going to be the free coffee. Si pasa, dígame dónde va. Okay, a teacher. <laughs> okay. <laughs> How do you Teacher. feel, Anna? How is it going? Yes. Um, now I'm not okay. It was uh, the weekend. It was very hard. Uh, now um, about about that, I feel better, but I'm not. I'm not okay. Okay, and what seems to be 
the problem. What seems to be the problem? The first, uh, the first one, we think that it was the vaccine, the, COVID vaccine. The vaccine. But, vaccine. But then uh, it is complicated because uh, I have a lot of symptoms like a fever, uh, scalofrios, a pain about all my uh, body, todo el cuerpo, uh, yeah. headache, uh, articulaciones. Uh, so I visit the is on ay, jueves. Ay, ni siquiera me acuerdo cómo dice, se dice jueves. Thursday. Okay. Thursday and uh, Friday, it was very uh, complicated because I was in the Primero de Mayo hospital. Oh, really? Yeah, and I had um, some specific uh, exams to discard another problem. Illness. Illnesses. Yeah, and supuestamente it's not the, it's not that, but uh, I need to check with another doctor to discard if I am okay about that specific problem. Okay. Because well. now I have the symptoms in less in less um ¿cómo sería? con menor eh, fuerza intensity with less in intensity but I, I i have the symptoms now so uh, you know don't worry don't worry you think you'll see that everything will come out okay ya va a pasar no se preocupe and if not let me know I need my coffee. It's support me. Support yeah. me. That's the that's the way I, I, I give support. Es la manera como yo doy apoyo. Let me know where there's going to be free coffee, okay? Okay. And please, please, good bread y buen pan, okay? Okay. Now nah, you'll get better. You'll get better soon. Ya se nos va a mejorar. Cuando menos sienta. It's nice Eso when we espero. wake up. It's nice when we wake up and the symptoms are gone. Yeah. That's the best feeling. You'll see, you'll see. Vacaciones ha de querer. I don't have vacation now because I start to work in the company in November. So Ooh. I don't have. Uh -huh. Don't have vacation. Um, Friday and Saturday, I had a listen of, of absence and I tried to take in a rest, but, but I need maybe two days more. I don't know. Yeah, to be back on at the same level. Mm. At yeah. normal rhythm. Yeah, that's, that happens. But don't worry, don't worry. It will pass. Yes, Wilfredo, you were telling me. I, I, I have a question. If yes. I'm talking about characteristic about a manager, um, may I say he has to have or he has to? I, I, I don't remember, teacher. Well, it depends. He has to have or he has to. He has to have. Como ya lleva el tú. Es have, la segunda vez. Ah, okay. He has to have or he has to be. No, he has to have. Because I, okay. uh, I, I talk about... It depends about... on the characteristic. Yeah, yeah. Okay. Because we we were talking about um, about the manage, all manage who will be know to work as a team or trabajar en equipo. Yeah, teamwork. Teamwork. They they have to 
they have to have this characteristic because yeah, it's very the, important. Yeah, but this this is was my my confused teacher. Okay, no problem. I'll be back. Thank you. Okay. How's, your, how's, your, how's your connection now? What is the connection? And now it's, it's trust. <laughs> okay, okay, perfect, perfect. How do you do with characteristics? How do you do with characteristics? I'm work. <laughs> okay. I'll be back I'm in a minute. On... Okay. No dan otra opción de horario. Ajá, uh -huh, but what were you telling the teacher what? ¿Qué dijo el profesor? <laughs> Nada, nothing special, teacher. Okay, okay. I was worried. I was worried. I, I was going to get my gloves on. Yo me voy a poner los guantes. <laughs> so, how you doing? You finish with the characteristics? Yes. Okay, let me let me tell the group that in 60 seconds we we'll go back to the main room, okay? Okay, teacher. Hey, teacher. Okay, let's see, everybody's back. Yes, 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 yes. Okay, first group, I got Daniel, Elvia, and Shanira. Okay, Daniel, tell me, please, as a group, what do you think are the characteristics for a good manager? Uh, we believe the that a good man manager should be good with numbers. Okay. Uh, they should know what activities made the company lost more money. Okay, interesting. Uh, good at working in team. Okay, good teamwork. Teamwork. Uh, commit with the company goals. Committed, committed. Committed. Comprometido, right? Yeah. Okay, perfect. And to have, well, he should be gentle, a good leader, and an example for the other people, for the rest of the company. Okay, let's see. Thank you very much. Excellent. Well done. Thank you. Group number two, Fernando, Nicolás, and Silvia. Let's see, Silvia has not talked to me. Silvia, are you around? Hello, teacher, how are you? Okay, I'm just fine, how are you? I'm good, thank you. I'm just oh. arriving home. Oh, really? So you didn't do yes. the activity with the group? Ah uh, yes, yes I did. Okay, tell me what uh, what characteristics do you think as a group that a good manager should have? Ah uh, yes, a manager should be polite. Okay, polite. Uh, Interesting. Yes, a manager should be professional in his his or her work. Um, 
a manager should be communicator. Communicative. 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 Okay. And a manager yeah. should be an attentive person. Okay. And, Good and a manager should be a patient person. Patient. Okay. Pretty nice yeah. characteristics. Excellent. Thank you. Appreciate okay. it, Sylvia. You. Thank you. Group number three, Francisco, Marta, and Susana. Let's see who's going to talk to me here. Mm -hmm. Marta, your turn. You're up. Tell me. For the thing, uh, the characteristic for the good uh, manager is a leader. Okay. Uh, is uh, honestly. An honest uh, person. An honest person uh, is a patient person. Patient. Is a perseverant person. Perseverant. Uh, perseverant. A really like responsibility with your job. A good relationship with the many people. Okay, with his job. With his job. So the L, his. Yes. Okay, thank you. Uh, his job is a good relationship with uh, many people, um, good sense, quality, assurance uh, in, in his job. Okay. When you say that a good relationship with people, that's a, a people's person. So it's, as he says, a people's person. Okay. When, when somebody is a people's person, that person is that is one who, who can talk like freely with everybody and makes people feel comfortable with him or with her, you know? That's a okay. people's person, okay? Okay, thank you, teacher. You're welcome. Okay, now group number four was Maria Alejandra, Roxana Asensio, and Wilfredo. Okay, Maria, you tell me. I think uh, the manager needs to work as a teamwork and the manager has to have a lot of knowledge of all the assignment department and the important information of the company. Okay, perfect. perfect. Uh, uh, have a human qualities. And human, empathy. human. Human. Uh, have a human quality and empathic and respect of the team. Okay. The team. And have an open mind and, and listening all the different opinions to shame. Okay. Shame. Here, here you have to say be, be open minded. Okay. Be open minded. Be open minded. Like this, be uh, open-minded. Yeah. Excellent, thank you very much, Maria. Now, Ambar and Francisco Eduardo. Ambar, tell me, talk to me. Okay, the manager should be an um, empathic person with his em employees. He should be um, responsible with his action in the company. He, um, he must have um, emotional intelligence and- Okay, emotional he, intelligence. Yes. Okay. <laughs> he, he should be, uh, no, he must have um, assertive com, com, communication with his- okay. Employees and um yeah he he should be um proactive person with his team. Okay, what is a proactive person? How do you describe a proactive person? Um I don't know that term. They... No conozco ese termino. So explain that term to me. 
eh, how do you say tener iniciativa? Mm. What do you mean by that? ¿Cómo así? Eh, bueno, es decir, cómo se es... dar el... To lead. That's what you mean, to lead. To lead. To lead, dirigir. Yes, um, uh, it's important to, he, he should be an example for his employees, uh, for example, in sales, um, and as um, supervisor, he must, must be, I no sé cómo es. <laughs> Tell me, tell me, tell me, talk to me. Even if you cannot tell me in Spanish, but if not, try to explain the word. Okay, eh, por ejemplo, lo puedo decir en español, entonces. Just the word, solo la palabra que no, que no encuentro. Ay, sí, todas no las he. <laughs> eh, I think that eh, he, he must give um example for his employees. Um, I saw Richie, teacher. I lost my idea. Okay. No problem, no problem. That happens. Thank you very much, Amber. Thank you. Let's see, I got Claudia Ramos, Jose Osorio, and William Rosales. Who's gonna talk to me? Jose, you just opened your camera. So it's your turn, tell me, Jose. Mr. Jose Osorio, talk Hello? to me, tell, tell me, tell me, what characteristics do you think a good manager should have? Uh, the way we see it, uh, a good man manager is, must be a, a person organized and proactive, leadership and ability to solve problems. Okay. And must have a uh, numerical ability. And it must be a person who, like, how do you say that an example in, in English? Okay. To be an example. Uh, okay. <laughs> It must be a person to be an example uh, for the others to to follow and motivate them. Okay. Another way, perhaps the most proper way, quizás la manera más correcta sería esta. A person who sets the example. Sets. Yep. S E T S. Yep. Set. Um, must be a person who sets an example. A good example. Must be a person who set sets a good example for the others to follow. Perfect. Perfect sentence. Excellent. Thanks. Thanks, Thanks to you. Okay, guys, very well done, very well done, everyone. Today's class is a little bit different because we are finishing the, the, the unit, okay? So today's class is going to vary a little bit to the rest of the classes. La clase de ahora va a variar un poco porque estamos finalizando la unidad, okay? So it's going to be a little bit different, but uh, remember mostly whenever we have something different, I always try to take advantage of you speaking. Recuérdense, siempre voy a tratar de, de lograr que lo que más hagamos es que ustedes me hablen. Okay? So, let's continue. Enjoy, Maria. Let's continue, guys. Let me see. Before we move on, I need to take attendance again. Wow, time flies. El tiempo vuela. Okay, okay. Amber Eli Alfaro Gomez. 
present teacher. Carlos Antonio Murillo Hernández. Carlos es missing. Claudia Elizabeth Ramos Barrientos. Present. Daniel Eduardo Segueda Valencia. Present teacher. Eduardo Adamir Noyola Brito. Elvia Janet Beltrán de Cabrera. Present teacher. Thanks. Fernando Marvin González Martínez. Present teacher. Francisco Eduardo Figueroa Mejía. Present teacher. José Ernesto Osorio Morán. Present teacher. María Alejandra Barrientos Romero. Present teacher. María Luisa Morales de Corpeño. Marta Ana Belinda Morales de Portillo. Present teacher. Nicolás Atilio Méndez Granados. Present teacher. Here. Roxana Ivette Asensio de Mejía. Present. Silvia Elizabeth de Bendaño Pineda. Present. Susana Beatriz Ortiz de Cornejo. Present teacher. Walter Mauricio Morales Araujo. Wilfredo Guardado Rivera. Present teacher. William Giovanni Rosales Galvez. Present teacher. Shanira Elizabeth Asensio García. Present teacher. Francisco José Méndez Aguilar. Present. Thank you, mister. And Linda Marlene Acosta Barrera. Okay, let's see. Mm. Maria Luisa, I could have sworn she was here. Okay, guys, let's continue. Well, today we are going to watch a little bit also of vocabulary, okay? And we are going to read a very interesting paragraph, okay? And the paragraph, it's in the manual, in the Insafor manual, in page number 17. When you got your manual, please go to page number 17. Okay? We are going to read. Okay, read this internet article about five requirements of the perfect manager. Number one, be a people person. Narxal is people and we are looking for managers who like people. You should be comfortable with conflict resolution. You should know how people work and know how to motivate your team. If you are better with computers than people and understand Klingon better than English, you are not a good fit for our managerial team. Number two, be a good communicator. I'm sorry, in number one, questions about vocabulary? Number one, preguntas con vocabulary? Yes, teacher. Tell me. Uh, North Star. Oh, it's the name of the company. It's the name of the company. Thanks, teacher. Okay. You know what's Klingon. Klingon, right? Okay, who asked me that? Klingon. Who asked me that? Who asked me that? It's Roxana. Oh, no. I think you are too young for that. Okay, I'm going to say some more comments. Klingon, if I'm not mistaken, so no me equivoco, that's uh, Star Trek, a language that appeared in Star Trek, un lenguaje que aparece en la serie, película, sí, serie, Viaje a las Estrellas. Oh my gosh. In the Big Bang Theory, teacher. I'm 
I'm sorry. Yes, I remember. Oh yeah, yeah in the Big Bang Theory also. But mm -hmm. it, it first appears in the Star Trek, Klingon. Okay, Roxana? Yes. Roxana is too young, está muy chiquita. That's why she doesn't go. Yes. And in the Mandalorian. <laughs> Oh, also in the Mandalorian. Yeah, that's true. Okay, let's continue. Number two. Number two, be a good communicator. You should be able to communicate effectively using all methods, including visual presentations, public speaking, email, teleconferencing, and face-to-face. -face. Good communication is a two-way street. You will be required to, to routinely update your employees on their and the team's performance. Performance. You will communicate any feedback from upper management and customers and provide status information when asked. Questions about vocabulary. Upper management. I'm sorry? Upper management. Upper management. Eh, mm -hmm. Acuérdese que siempre hay gerencias o puestos más altos. Final. Eh, Rutinarios. Ok. Mario. o rutinariamente. Ok, and the pronunciation is routinely, routinely, routinely. Yeah, routinely. Teacher. Yes, routinely. That's the pronunciation. Teacher. Yes. Can I ask you something? Yeah, tell me. Uh, What's the correct pronunciation to the word require or retire? I remember other other teacher says retire. Retire. Donde, 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 donde. You will Where be required it? to routinely. Oh, you the, will be the second required. Part of, require. Uh, re, re, require or retire. No, require. It's not the same. Oh, that, I mean, require is require. I don't know which is the other one. Okay. No sé cuál es la otra que ha visto. Because this I is... remember, I remember it's the same word. No, but that's oh. require. Or, or, Let or me see. It's my bad. <laughs> Hold on. You would be required. Okay. Thanks. Yeah, require. Yeah, they, this word is required. Required, okay. Routinely, required to it. routinely update. Okay, okay now it. let's, thank you. Number three, we'll go to number three, okay? Number three, be technically proficient. The products we create at Norxel are technically complicated. You don't need to be able to call in C, but you should be able to give technical guidance and decide the best strategies and methods for success. And no, having watched Happy Feet or The March of the Penguins does not qualify you as technically proficient in Linux. Okay, that's cool. Let's see, this is... I think this is clear, no, yeah, no new vocabulary. Number four, encourage teamwork. Teamwork is important at Norxol. Not only are you required to encourage the best practices for building teamwork, you are considered a part of the team. We have no doors at Norxol for you to hide behind. In fact, we have no traditional office space for managers. You are required to sit and work with your staff. Number five, lead by example. 
The best managers lead by example at North. All managers are required to dress and act professionally at all times and to be available to give guidance and help when needed. Leading by example means working late and on weekends with your employees, parking with your employees, and using the same washroom as your employees. It's all about doing instead of pontificating and doing the right thing. Interesting. Pontificating, pontificar. Do you know the word pontificar in Spanish? Cuando alguien está pontificando, I'm sorry, I will explain in Spanish because it's easier. Eh, cuando alguien está pontificando es cuando se pone a decir, sí, nosotros debemos de hacer esto, comportarnos de esta manera, pero la persona no lo hace. Simplemente lo dice para los demás. Y sí, como empresa, tenemos que trabajar en grupo y tenemos que ser colaboradores y dedicarnos, pero la persona no lo hace. In that case, that person is pontificating. ¿Ok? Now, guys, what are you going to do? There, in the paragraph, even though it's clear, the language they are using is not quite clear. Now, I'm going to divide you in five groups. And in those groups, you are going to explain to me in easy words, okay? What is each one of them? Okay, you are going to focus. Be a people person, be a good communicator, be technically proficient, encourage teamwork, lead by example, okay? You are going to explain to me in your own words, okay? I don't want the, the exact vocabulary that is there. I want you to explain it as you can, okay? In your own vocabulary. Questions about the activity? Pregunta con actividad. Hey, teacher, please repeat, please, por. Okay, the activity is this. I'm going to divide you in groups, okay? Lo voy a dividir en grupos. Now, group number one is Amber, Maria Alejandra, Susana, William. They're going to explain me, ellos me van a explicar en sus propias palabras, what is to be a people person. Okay, ser una people person. In your own vocabulary, guys. Now, group number two is Daniel, Francisco, Francisco, and Wilfredo. Okay, what is group number two going to explain to me? Group number two is going to explain to me what is to be a good communicator. Que okay. ser un buen com communicator as a manager, como un manager. Okay, what does it imply? Que implica como un gerente to be a good communicator? Group number three, that's Claudia Ramos, Elvia, and Chanira. You are going to explain to me number three. Be technically proficient, okay? So you're going to explain to me, but in easy words, okay? Don't let Janira to get too technical. No dejen que Janira se nos ponga muy técnica, okay? Because that's her area, actually. But you need to, 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 to don't be down for me, Janira, okay? Group number two. Marta Morales, Nicolás Méndez, and Roxana Sensio. Group number two are going to explain to me encourage teamwork. Okay. How do you encourage teamwork as a manager? Okay. Recuerdense, todo desde el punto de vista de un manager. And group number five, that is Fernando, Jose, and Silvia, you are going to explain the last one, which is lead by example. Easy, cheesy. That's, I think, well, all of them are easy. Todos están fáciles. You will have five minutes. Discuss, okay, as much as possible in English. And then we come back here and I'm going to pick one person. Yo voy a escoger una persona to explain to me, okay, in simple words. Palabras simples, sencillas. Is it clear now? ¿Estamos claros? Yes, teacher. Thank you. Perfect. Okay, guys, let's jump in. Let's do it. Four minutes.
Okay, let's go check on their groups. Let's see, let's see. What's going on, guys? I don't hear you. Excuse me, <laughs> but uh, for me, uh, a good manager is a people person, but um, understand the, how do you say su alternos, teacher? Well, well uh, technically that's sub alterns. Alter. Realmente eso sería subalternos, subalterns. You should. But what you mean are the, the employees, no? Employees. Oh, okay. You can say subordinate. Subordinate. Okay. Subordinate. Subordinate. Okay. Understand subordinate uh, when, when they they have um, they have um, a situation with your family with their family their family mm -hmm. their family um, and them or two um Parar, teacher. Separate. Separate um, the the time, the time, um, time the job with a time of free time. Yeah, but what about the rest? Hello guys. What do you think? Hello. Hi teacher. Hi. How's it going? Daniel, what's your opinion? I believe we that a good communicator should be clear in what they say. Okay. And they have to be confident with with himself. And uh, of course he if he made a mistake, he should at I accept that and because we learn about everything from everyone okay perfect nice nice analysis keep on guys continue excellent thanks mm -hmm. to be clear don't beat around the bush <laughs> Okay, don't write in cold, Janita. I, I, I don't be technician teacher. Okay, hey, yeah, don't be around the bush. No andarse con rodeos. That's exactly, exactly what it means. Eso es lo que significa exactamente. What do you say, Elvia? Can you just play again? Bueno, no sé si por eso no me acuerdo. Ah, okay. Uh, say a person who sets the example. Who set? Set. 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 Set.
Recuérdense que estamos hablando de la tercera yeah. persona. Por eso le agregamos la S al final. Sets. Yes. Show. Hmm. Make employees in corner for the company. Must be a person with empathy. Digo yo. An empathic person. Empathic. Empat person. Empathic. Like this? Empathic. Must be a person with yeah. empathy. Yeah, with empathy. Sure. Empathy. Empathy. Yes, Fernando. Uh, what is what is the, the better um, conditional? Must be or should be? For this case. Okay. Must be expresa obligación. Debe ser, ¿verdad? Yep. Should be, podría, puede ser. Yeah. I must be. Okay. Okay, I'm my... Who works together and make employees feel productive and important for the company. Productive, uh, productive. Productive. Make employees. Yes. No. ¿En William? The manager must be proactive. Uh, um, it's okay. But it's too hard. My arm is of feel very heavy. It's like, uh, I don't know what to say, but it feel heavy, my arm. And the hay dutch, it's very hard. I it's imagine. The, the, the first dose. Yeah, today was my first. Bye. Bye. You didn't drink um, acetaminophen before? Yeah, right? yeah. I I I drank some two tablets in I the drank. afternoon. I drank. Sorry, sorry. I drank two tablets in the afternoon, but now it's no past the eight hours, <laughs> and will be to wait for the the eight hours passed. H H eight hours. Yeah, it's eight hours for to be epic. I think so. You are going to be good tomorrow. Man. Yeah, I hope after, it. I hope after, it, man. It to be okay. Sleep, you are going to be good. Yeah. 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 Teacher, I I got a question for you. Uh, in, Tell me. Okay. In, on in Saturday, I have. Uh, some here about say first God, but I don't know in Spanish, in primero Dios, but in English, I, I don't know what to say. But first God is not, doesn't exist, no, God's first, God's first, yeah, ah, okay, perfect, thank you. <laughs> You're welcome. Okay. okay, guys, what more we can talk about the uh, characteristics? Uh, yeah, uh, I think so was a, a good one because a song manager or chief manager have to need to empathy. But have to a good, what? A good person with person <laughs> with another 
uh, with another, not customers, no, employees. Okay, I'm sorry guys to interrupt. Uh, I was just remembering something, Francisco. Uh, lo que pasa es que usted quiere dar la expresión de primero Dios, ¿verdad? Yeah. Okay. Perdón, I hear, I hear in the market. <laughs> I hear okay. in the market some some minister say, "Oh yeah, fears God," and okay. say to my wife, "This exact doesn't exist." <laughs> exactamente, exactamente. O sea, usted puede decir primero Dios. That's God's first. Yeah. Pero con la uh, ¿Cómo le explico? Con la intención, ¿ok? Con la intención que lo está usando ahí, es distinto. Ahí usted lo que tiene que decir es esto, mire. Esta es la idea que usted transmite en inglés, que es como un equivalente Hopefully. a lo que nosotros transmitimos al decir okay. primero Dios. Hopefully. ¿Okay? Como que con fe. Con esperanza. Con esperanza, ¿ok? Porque faith sería en todo caso, así que sería sí. como esperanzado. Sí, pero como recuérdense que aquí no estamos traduciendo, sino que interpretando. Uh -huh. Ok. Porque la idea que usted transmite con la expresión, primero Dios, en inglés se transmite diciendo, hopefully. Okay. Hopefully. Ok, perfecto. Thank you, teacher. Ok. Okay, guys, finish. You ready? Yeah. Yeah. Okay. Yeah. Yeah. Go sure. to the main room. We're just going to wait for the rest of the people to come here because we need to discuss this and then do another activity. Okay, let's see. Let's see, let's see, let's see, let's see. Group number one. I got Ambar, Maria Alejandra, Susana, and William. Okay, guys, the whole group, todo el grupo, open up your microphones and please explain to me, all of you guys as a group, tell me what is to be a people person. In my case, I think that it's important the manager should be a, a good leader and should be an example for his employees. And Okay, perfect, perfect, perfect. Amber, thank you very much. But I need the rest of the people also to talk. Okay, sorry. teacher. Thank you. Maria Alejandra, what about you? Uh, the manager have a different abilities for example, to conflict resolution, patience, or um, eh, extroverted, I don't know. Extroverted? Extroverted, um, motivate all the team for work well, or is a team. The whole team, the whole. Motivate the whole team. Okay, but, perfect. Stop, Maria. Thank you. I'm sorry to stop you, but I need to hear William. William, tell me. William. 
Hello. What is to be a people's person? The manager, uh, I must be motivated. Okay. Responsible. Must be a Responsible, reliable. Reliable. Yes. Uh, be one example uh, for, okay. the, for a lot of employees. Thank you very much. Leave it like that. Leave it like that because Susana wants to participate too. Thank you very much, William. Susana? Okay. Uh, uh, Oopsie, Susana. I think we're having problems with the connection. For me, the, the man. Yes, Susana. Okay. Uh, the man oh. for me has period uh, feedback with your um, other, other employees, um, but uh, the uh, has has or um, on or think the think um with your the with your uh, the his, other with his people. or her her so how do you say para saber qué piensan to know what they think hmm. ah, okay you know you are, would think mm -hmm. perhaps not to know quizás no saber understand what they think okay okay thank you very much group number two i got daniel eduardo daniel eduardo francisco francisco and wilfredo okay guys please let's make it short one sentence each one be a good communicator. Let's start with Daniel. What is the a way a good, good communicator? communicator? Should be clear in what they want to express to the other people. To be clear on what they express to other people. Perfect. Francisco Eduardo, your turn. Uh, I think a good communicator. Uh, should be a, a person with a fluent communication. A okay. No, in this case, it's fluid. Fluid. Yeah. Okay, teacher. Uh, fluid communication and make a with a, a partner. A, Free uh, communication in write uh, an email, write a report. And okay, perfect. That's enough. That's enough. Thank you very much, Francisco Jose. Your turn. Okay, teacher. Okay, teacher. In my opinion, uh, the good manager will be uh, empathy with employees because in other partner says. To, to be a good fluency with another one. But I think so what's the, best, uh, the very important in this case will be to, to change the, the community for to be a good person with another person. Okay, to be a good person to the rest of the people. Yeah, to the rest person. To the rest of the people. Of oh, the rest of the people, sorry. Perfect, thank you very much. Now, Claudia Ramos, Elvia Chanet, Walter Mauricio, and Shanira Elizabeth. You got, what is to be technically proficient? Okay, what is to be technically proficient, Claudia Ramos? I think um, it has to be a good, how do you call it, a stratega? Strategies. Strategies. Yep. Because uh, he decided the best is a stra strategies. A strategies and method for success. 
Okay, perfect. Thank you very much. Now let's see, Elvia, your turn. Um, when about the making a thing tax and the products hey to meet customer need. Okay, to meet the customer's need. Perfect. Walter Mauricio. What do you think? Walter. It's Walter. Oops. He said that he have problem with the microphone and he only hear. Okay, Shanira, your turn. Okay, I think so, uh, to be clear, and have ability to explain clear and easily. Don't, for example, don't be beat around the brush. Okay, don't beat around the bushes. Do you understand that expression, guys? No. Okay, to beat around Roxana, the bush. Roxana. Okay, let's see, it's this uh, 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 bit around the bushes. That means a uh, andarse con rodeos. Okay, to beat around the bushes. Esa expresión exactamente significa andarse con rodeos. Okay, let's see. What about you, Janira? Yep, it is. Okay, thank you. What about you, Janira? What's your opinion? Um, this is my opinion. Uh, to be okay. clear, have ability to explain clear and easy. Don't beat around the brushes. Okay, thank you very much. Now let's see. I got Marta Morales, Nicolás, and Roxana. You are going to talk to me, guys, about uh, encourage teamwork. Okay, how do you encourage teamwork, Marta? Uh, uh, I think so, encourage teamwork. Teamwork is um, the manager, he could be sit and work with the teams for a person who sets the example. Okay, a person who sets the example. Perfect, thank you very much. Nicolas, what about you? Okay, teacher, uh, the manager is, uh, is a person who encourage at the team okay. and- who who? No what? Who? Who? Who encourage at the team? And other characteristic is include include uh, or, or other uh, include uh, other person at the team. Okay, includes 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 and other person at the team. Okay, perfect. Excellent, excellent. Now, Roxana, what about you? What do you think, Roxana? What's your opinion? Uh, the manager has to, to give uh, the motivation to work with empathy using using open door with, uh, to show the trust. To show trust, not to, to show, show the trust. trust. To mm -hmm. show trust. Okay, let me take that word for the rest of the guys here to show or to demonstrate mm -hmm. trust. Mostrar confianza. Yes. Okay. Thank you very much, Roxana. Now let's see. And group number five, Fernando, Jose, and Silvia. Okay, Fernando, please explain to me in your own words, what is to lead with by example? Um, 
in my opinion, lead by example means uh, that managers should not ask his employees, his employees for something that he doesn't want to do. Perfect. I like that, specific. Daniel, what about you? Oops, I'm sorry, I'm sorry, I'm sorry, I'm no. sorry. Jose Osorio, Jose Osorio. Uh, must be a person who interacts with the employees and must have initiative and must be a person with empathy. Okay, perfect. Excellent. Sylvia, what about you? What's your opinion on this? Uh, a manager should be like available and okay. try to work together with the employees. And when there is a problem, uh, they shouldn't point someone or be angry. Mm. They should try to look for a solution. Okay, perfect. So they should control themselves. Yes. Excellent, excellent. Excellent to you all guys, you did pretty well. I know today activities have been like kind of different. Entiendo que la actividad de ahora han sido un poquito distintas. But remember, the objective today was for you to use should. Me han estado utilizando should, could. Did you notice you've been using the grammar? Hemos estado utilizando el grammar. We've been, we also have been using the vocabulary. The vocabulary we were practicing the whole week through the way you were speaking. And I, I would like to, I would like to congratulate you guys. No problem. I see that uh, even though for some of you has been a little bit harder, you are all trying to speak as much as possible in English. That's excellent. Please don't forget tonight is the, the platform. Okay, esta noche yo paso las notas. Actually, I already start, I started already, ya comencé. But we are not finished yet. We are going to do another activity. Let's see, guys. Here we go. Okay, we go again to the manual. Let's see. Let's see, let's see. It's more important to manage Systems than people, Janira, true or false? Yes, it's true. It's true that it's more important to manage systems than people? Uh, no, no, I'm sorry, I understand. <laughs> but mm, yes, it's more important than people. Yeah, uh, a programmer always the same. <laughs> yeah, yeah. Actually, this is false. Perfect. Now, Ambar, to be a great communicator, one should use as many tools as possible. Mm. True or false? Uh, true. True. Perfect, Ambar. That's correct. Now, okay. uh, Daniel. Your turn. In order to be technically proficient, giving one's opinion is enough? False. False. You need to study, you need to prepare, you need to look for information, right? Yeah. Excellent. Excellent. Now, encouraging teamwork is as important as being part of the team. Let's see, Fernando, what do you think? True or false? Uh, true. True. Excellent, yes, right. You know, it's very important not just to encourage teamwork. It's important to be part of the team, to motivate. And that's what you've been telling me. Now, let's see, let's see who's going to get the last one. Mr. Or Mrs. Let's see, let's see, let's see, let's see, let's see. Jose Osorio, if you are a manager, you can skip extra work and have weekends off? False. False. Okay. 
Yeah, because if you are a manager, you need to be there. Right? I mean, you need to be in the trenches. Right? Okay, guys, let's uh, continue. I'm sorry. I'm sorry, I'm sorry, I need to get... Uh, Let me close this. Okay, now this is homework. Write a seven line paragraph about your work experience and personal information, such as studies, experience, and other jobs. Use time expressions. You're going to do this. And remember, you send it to me privately, okay? Eso me lo envían ustedes privadamente. Okay, and it's always good if you can do the self-assessment. Okay, now I can write a paragraph about my work experience independently with occasional help, only with help. Okay, please do your assessment. It, it is important to do the self-assessment because it will tell us, it will tell you sincerely how good you are and if you send me the picture of the whole thing of the paragraph and the self-assessment, it will help me to see how can I help you, okay? So now, if you notice we've been working like uh, talking about jobs, jobs experience, that's very important because this program is English for work and something that we need to command is the vocabulary we use in a resume and the vocabulary that you are going to need for a job interview, okay? Now, if we make a little review of what we've been doing in this whole unit, si hacemos un pequeño repaso lo que hemos visto en esta unidad, we have gotten the vocabulary for a resume. Hemos visto parte del vocabulario de un resume. Hoja de vida, okay? That's a resume or also part of the vocabulary that you use in a job interview, right? O parte del vocabulario que usted utilizaría en una entrevista de trabajo, okay? Now, the last activity of this unit is the one that you are going to send me tomorrow, okay? Eh, yo voy a estar revisando posiblemente mañana las que me han enviado ayer, ahora, y las que me envían mañana, mañana por la tarde. Okay, what are you going to do? The activity says, you write a file, a seven line paragraph about your work experience and personal information such as studies, experience and other jobs. Nos hemos venido preparando para eso, okay? In the whole unit, the whole week, we've been like preparing for that, to finish with that information. Now you are going to make it more in order. You write your name, okay? ¿Qué sigue después del nombre cuando presentamos un resume? Personal that, okay. We are going to obviate the personal that. But studies, job experience, okay? I want that. ¿Se recuerdan que lo hicimos ya en un cuadrito? Now we are going to do it as a paragraph. Why do we do that? ¿Por qué hacemos esto? Okay. Uh, some companies in the United States ask you for this. Algunas compañías en Estados Unidos le piden esto. You present your resume and you present like a letter of introduction. Usted presenta su resume en un folder o en un sobre, pero también le agrega una letter of introduction. Le agrega una carta de introducción. Ok. Where you say your name, you talk about yourself, your job experience, your studies, okay? Usted habla sobre sus estudios, su experiencia laboral. And the documents are enclosed. Y usted termina la carta, al final le pone documents enclosed. Y esa expresión en close quiere decir que van en un sobre. Hoy le llamamos nosotros, antes le decíamos agrega, no le decimos um, atestados. Right? 
que son todos los documentos que comprueban lo que hemos dicho en la primera parte del, del, del resumen. Ok, now what do I want? ¿Qué es lo que yo quiero? Something like a letter of introduction. Like this, it would be like this. Sería como esta, imagine that you're writing. Hey, my name is Douglas Arevalo. I am an English teacher. I have been an English teacher for 21 years. I have, I studied to become an English teacher at Universidad Pedagógica de El Salvador. I have had the, I graduated from the university in the year 2002. I finished high school in 1996. Okay. And I have worked in different areas related to English. I have worked as a, trans, as a translator, as, a, as I have worked with others uh, at the university, at Universidad Pedagogica. I have worked also with others at Universidad Don Bosco. And let me see what else. I have worked teaching teenagers at Colegio Garcia Flamenco, in some public schools, Catholic schools. And I have also worked with Catholic communities or with American fellows. I worked with them from 2004 to 2008, 2008. And I love teaching. That's my specialty and that's something that I enjoy. My area of expertise is working, teaching English to others. Although I have also teach from the basic levels with kids. You see? Ahora imagínense que eso lo presenté por escrito. Okay. What am I going to check? Capitals, punctuation. Aparte del vocabulario, la puede revisar también. Mayúsculas y puntuación. Okay. Teacher, is this, it's is the homework uh, from for, the page for eight, 18. Yep. Okay. Solamente les explicaba el por qué lo, por qué se lo estoy pidiendo así. Y perdón, lo explicaré nuevamente, pero ahora en español. En Estados Unidos, a veces les decía, nosotros ponemos los documentos en un sobre ponemos nuestro currículum, pero también le ponemos como una carta de introducción, donde hacemos uh, summarize, un resumen, ¿ya? Yeah? Summarize de, 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 de lo que está sustentado con la documentación, que es un poquito de información personal, un poquito de experiencia laboral y un poquito de estudios realizados, ¿ok? Entonces, eso es lo que quiero. Eso es lo que le estoy pidiendo. Y le explico el por qué es bueno que lo hagamos así. Nunca se sabe. Lo podemos utilizar, right? So, guys, that's for tomorrow. Before we leave, I need to get the attendance. Any question about the activity? Antes que les pase la asistencia, ¿alguna pregunta más? No, no teacher. No, okay. Thank you. Perfect. Ambarelli Alfaro Gómez. Present teacher. Carlos Antonio Murillo. Claudia Elizabeth Ramos Bar Barrientos. Present. Daniel Eduardo Segueda Valencia. Present teacher. Eduardo Ademir Noyola Brito. Elvia Chanet Beltrán de Cabrera. Present teacher. Fernando, Fernando Marvin González Martínez. Present teacher. Francisco Eduardo Figueroa Mejía. Present teacher. José Ernesto Osorio Morán. Present teacher. María Alejandra Barrientos Romero. Present teacher. María Luisa Morales de Corpeño. Marta Navelinda Morales de Portillo. Present teacher. Nicolás Atilio Méndez Granados. Present teacher. Roxana Iberta Asensio de Mejía. Present. Silvia Elizabeth Arendaño Pineda. Present. Susana Beatriz Ortiz de Cornejo. Present. Walter Mauricio Morales Araujo. I got you, I got you, Walter. Don't worry, don't worry. Wilfredo Guardado Rivera. Present teacher. Mira Elizabeth Asensio. Yeah, I heard you, Walter. Present teacher. Thank you, Francisco José Méndez Aguilar. 
Present teacher. Linda Marlene Acosta Barrera. Okay, guys. Thank you very much. See you tomorrow. Don't forget the platform, please. No se les olvide la plataforma para ahora. Yes. No me nombro. William. I'm sorry, my friend. Let's see, William Giovanni Rosales Galvez. Yeah, you are right. Okay, thank you very much, guys. See you tomorrow. Have a good night. Take good care. Good night, everybody. Bye bye. Good night. bye, -bye. Rest. Descansemos. Have a good night. Have a good night. Tengo problemas. Have a good night, Walter. Hey. <laughs> oh, I see, teacher. I listen to me. <laughs> yeah, finally. Ah, excuse me, uh, the problem, the connection, the internet, is, they are uh, and very day bad in the class. <laughs> no problem, Tomorrow. no problem. Tomorrow is going to be better. Bye, yes, teacher. Bye, bye. Thank you. Share una consulta. Dígame. Este... Y tenemos que trabajar lo de la plataforma, ¿verdad? Y sí. lo que está en el libro, algunas partes que no están ahí en la plataforma y que están acá en el libro. También, eso se la voy dejando las que necesito eh, que resolvamos. Lo enviamos por mensaje privado. Sí, please. Va, está bien. Gracias. You're welcome. Bye, bye. Bye. Okay, my dear Roxanne. Oh my gosh. Okay. Yes, I know. I know. Nah, nah, nah. You look okay. You look okay. ¿Cómo estamos? Mm, so I think that after the I don't know where Friday and weekend everything is okay. So you got like four or five days, five days already. Yeah. And it started with the vaccine. Yeah, I, I, uh, I took, no, I, I had, ¿cómo sería? Yo me, yo tomé la vacuna. I had. I had the vaccine. Eh, vaccine, vaccine. Vaccine, 30 June. Okay, June. Yeah, and, and from this day, uh, I had uh, symptoms. Okay, from that day on. From that day on, Eso quiere decir I a had partir de ese día. Sería for that. Hold on, hold ¿Cómo? on, se lo escribo, se lo escribo. From that day on. From that day on, I had I, symptoms. 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 Okay, really? Mm. Yeah. Um, and, and you are working. Yeah. And jueves is Thursday, right? Yeah. Esta es una de las cosas en las que a mí en las que yo fallo. Yo los días, los, los días de la semana los odio por eso, porque me confundo. Eh, on Thursday, I was working um, in the morning, yes. but in the afternoon, I, ha, I, I was so bad. So I report to my, to my boss and I went to my uh, doctor, but uh, my doctor, uh, give me um gave me gave me uh I, re reference referencia yeah reference reference to is general okay for emer em emergency 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 so i had a um, appointment this day with uh, the doctor but then is everything was um, 
todo fue una locura. It was hectic. Yeah, because the doctor, he, he was very eh, preocupado. Worried. Worried because eh, I had a lot of eh, pain in my, in my arm, in my axilla. How do you say axilla? Oh, armpit. ¿Cómo? Armpit. Ar armpit. So it, this part is very, very uh, delicate. Yeah, because it could be, it could be many things, but there are muchas cosas. Yeah, so in Thursday, uh, he gave me another reference uh, to go to the Primero de Mayo. Yeah. And I take an ambulance. Oh, really? To the I was. Yeah. I was taken. I was taken. I was taken. I was taken an ambulance. An ambulance. Yeah, and I had uh, another appointment with another doctor in the hospital, and then I come back to my home. But on Friday, I have I had um, exams and evaluation, different evaluation. And then I, I had another appointment with the doctor and checked the exams, the evaluation, yeah. and they discard the cancer. I know which one. Yeah, yeah, I know which yeah. one. Yeah, because eso le iba a preguntar cómo salió de la, ¿cómo se llama ese examen? Ultra. No, pero. Uh... En mi caso fue ultra. Solo con otra lección. Sí. Eh, okay. For that, I need to take another opinion. Yeah. Yeah, porque el otro examen es el que hacen con, ¿cómo se llama? Mamografía. No, 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 no. no. Radiografía. No, cuando biopsia. le tomen parte de biopsia. Biopsia. Biopsia, yeah. A mí me lo hacen para el estómago. Eh, this exam, this Evaluation is when you have a confirmation. Yeah. And you well, have. Not really, because I mean, I get it done like every year. I mean, me todos los años. For my, so, for my stomach. Mm -hmm. Whenever they do me an endoscopy, they always check. But in my case, because I got that chronic gastritis. Yeah, but when you told me our armpit pain, usually it's related with the uh, lymphomas and breast cancer. But let's take a deep breath, relax, and wait first for the, for example, results. Yeah. Because so I next mean, week. Yes, tell me. Next week, I have another uh, appointment with a private um, clinic. Oh, yeah. To have private. another private a clinic to opinion. have another opinion. Mm -hmm. Yeah, it's always good. It's always good. I mean, so my weekend from when something is Thursday, that delicate. Yes, it's being held. Yeah. Yeah. When something is that delicate, it's always good to get a second or third opinion. I mean, yeah. because the problem is this, whenever you get a referral to a specialist, the problem is that the specialist looks for signs of his area. And sometimes, I mean, I'm, done, I'm not saying that that's bad, no digo que eso sea malo. It's just that uh, sometimes you need somebody to check the whole, the overall situation. Yeah. I, I don't know if you understand me. No sé si me hago entender. O sea que los especialistas buscan enfocados a su área, pero a veces necesitamos ver el todo. But I mean, uh, look. Okay, do not buy. Uh, 
ante todo, do not buy worries. O sea, no, no nos preocupemos antes de, no nos sobreexaltemos antes de saber. Look, everything, everything can be solved. You know, my mama, my mama, she's a, she's a, she is, she had cancer. Ella tuvo cancer. In her throat, en su garganta, the tyrant. She's got a surgery from here to here because they had to take it out. And it was, the surgery was 13 years ago. Hace 13 años. And she's there, por ahí anda. I mean, that's the extreme ca case. Es el caso extremo. Yeah. But let's wait, perhaps, I mean, it's not the only, the only problem you could have, no es lo único que podría tener. It's the extreme, it's the worst. But let's hope for the best, being prepared for the worst. Esperemos lo mejor, pero preparados para lo peor. I mean, it's always, yes. it's, this is a problem of attitude, okay? Something that influences a lot is attitude. Let me just check on something. How, oh, thanks to you. Thanks to you for the trust. Gracias por la confianza. Have a good night and whenever you want a word, y cuando quiera una palabra, una plática, I'm available 24 7, okay? Thank you, teacher. Have a good night. No, thanks to you. Good night. Good night. Take care. Well, well, well. Time's over. Let's see. And let's finish.